This was a study looking at the national landscape of gunshot wound injuries that are admitted to hospitals across the nation and require surgical intervention. We did not look at all gunshots. This is just a sector that require intervention, surgical intervention. And we looked at it over about to a 12 year period. We noted an increase in the overall frequency of surgically treated gunshot wounds, which is accompanied by a decrease in mortality from about 8.5% to 7.5%. We also noted several characteristics that were associated with increased cost utilization, and those were head and neck gunshot wounds, uh, vascular operations, several hospital factors and geographic factors that were unlikely to be patient-related, such as geography in the Western United States, were also associated with high cost. So taken together, our findings suggest that gun violence has increased in numbers, at least the sector that meets surgical criteria, and that they are leading to a substantial financial burden in addition to the obvious psychosocial burden and other downstream effects of violence. We hope that our findings are able to better inform our policy in terms of violence prevention, as well as remuneration for hospitals that care for these patients, which are often in underserved regions. It's just also important to note that the economic and the psychological cost of gunshot wounds do not stop when the patient is discharged. This stays with them and their families and their neighborhood for a very long time. So it's important to think about it in that context of how big this problem really is.